Hello friends, welcome to the first tutorial of English Grammar presented by me, Shishendu Mitra, Research Scholar of Indian Institute of Technology, Guwahati. In this particular video, I'll show you some awesome tricks of English Grammar. We generally do some mistakes while speaking, while writing, but here I present to you some tricks in order to write or speak properly. So first one is many a times we say anyways. What do we say? We say anyways. But the thing is anyways is a wrong usage of English because anyway is a because anyway is an adjective and plural form of ad adjective is not possible so anyways is a wrong english so what we should use we should use anyway instead of anyways but anyways are being used by a group of people but in english it is considered as a colloquial or slang so please stop using anyways and start using anyway okay uh, the next one sometimes we say the second one what do we say it is the most unique thing but this is a wrong usage of english so this one is incorrect why because whenever you are saying unique you need not mention most before that unique itself means some degree okay so the correct one is correct usage of english is it is a unique sorry it is a unique thing okay so the next one we some we sometimes say he is suppose a sentence i am writing he is wiser than brave मतलब वो लोग ज्यादा मतलब ये आदमी ज्यादा ज्ञानी है देवारी उसमें थोड़ा कम है यही बोलना चाहते हैं हम लोग बट द थिंग इज वेन एवर यू आर कंपेयरिंग टू थिंग्स फॉर अ सिंगल पर्सन देन यू शुड यूज मोर इंस्टीड ऑफ वाइज आर यू शुड यूज मोर सो द करेक्ट वन वुड बी ही इज मोर वाइज than brave you should not use wiser so that is a rule okay then we go for the next one the next one is sometimes we say suppose i am taking one example his failure is too much painful for me now here you need to understand uh, a simple thing and that is here painful is not a noun here painful is an unpleasant adjective okay you follow me this painful is not a noun painful is an unpleasant adjective and the rule is the rule is you use you always use much 
टू फॉलोड बाय और प्लस अनप्लीजेंट एडजेक्टिव ओके सो मार्च टू विल बी फॉलोड बाय दैट अनप्लीजेंट ऑब्जेक्टिव हियर पेनफुल सो द करेक्ट वन वुड बी करेक्ट वन इज करेक्ट वन इज his failure is much too painful for me so that one is the correct one but in general we use like this uh, incorrect sentence like his failure is too much painful for me for uh, but now onward after viewing this video you should use this as uh, as his failure is much too painful for me but when this comes to noun uh, what does it mean uh, we are uh, instead of this painful or instead of this adjective if there is any noun then too much is the correct one so the rule is too much followed by noun i will take another example suppose i am taking one example his wife apostrophe s wife root behavior gives him gives him much to pain now look at this particular position what i wrote ah uh, that would be double o yeah much to pain but here this one is incorrect because here pain is a noun it is not an adjective so instead of so this one is incorrect again and again i'm saying this one is incorrect so what would be the correct one i just copy it because i am lazy control c control v so the correct one is instead of much to you should write too much so this one is the correct one okay so we learned something so the next one suppose sometimes we say we compare a thing between two object okay like what i say what we say which is the best book of the two so we say which is the best book of this two but the thing is when you are comparing between two things that should not be a superlative degree that should be a comparative degree so the correct one would be which is the better book of the two so that one is the i am writing this one is the correct one this one is the incorrect one so you should remember correct and incorrect okay so coming to the next one suppose sometimes we say have you bought some mangoes have you have you bought some mangoes that is an incorrect one so i am writing it as incorrect the correct one would be have you bought or bought whatever some not some correct one is any mangoes so this one is the correct now 
just think uh, what is the wrong uh, with this sum and why any mangoes is the correct one so the thing is to express quantity or degree sum is used in affirmative sentences any in negative or interrogative sentences so i repeat here to express quantity here we are expressing quantity the quantity of mango so to express quantity or degree sum is used in affirmative sentences here this one is not an affirmative sentence this one is an interrogative sentence that is a question so we should use any instead of some so that is the rule you should remember okay so i write here correct and i go to the next one so i write correct first one is the wrong one second one is the correct one so next i'll take another good example suppose sometimes we say to compare things we say the popul say the population the population of bombay a bombay a city of india is greater than delhi so this one is an incorrect usage of english the proper english should be the population of bombay is greater than that of delhi so the thing is you should use or you should compare the same things between Then I mean to say you should compare the same thing. So what we are dealing with here, we are dealing with, or we are comparing the population of two cities. Those are Bombay and Delhi. So this that of means the population of Delhi, and population of Bombay we are just clearly saying there. So we are just comparing population of both the cities. But in the first one, this one is incorrect because. here the first thing is population of bombay but second thing we are just telling delhi delhi means the overall city uh, delhi does not represent the population of delhi that is why it cannot be said or cannot be written like this way the proper usage is the population of bombay is greater than that of delhi so i write this one is the correct one so i am going to another awesome example suppose sometimes we say nothing more can be done presently nothing more can be done presently okay so that one is a this is a sentence so this sentence is again incorrect why is it incorrect because you should understand one thing what we mean to say by this sentence nothing more can be done presently iska matlab hai abhi hum log aur kuch nahi kar sakte hain but in english presently basically represents shortly presently means shortly so what we wanted to convey we we did not convey we convert something else so the proper english which we wanted to convey is at present so we should write nothing more can be done at present okay so that one is the correct one and this one is the incorrect one incorrect rr is it yeah so 
थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग माई वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल आई विल बी अपलोडिंग वीडियोज ऑन इंग्लिश लाइक दिस दैट विल बी बेनिफिशियल टू यू थैंक यू वेरी मच